Hey guys, it's Tim Friedau here, and today I'll be reviewing AIMate, which is a chat GPT powered platform uh, that allows you to create uh, images like you're seeing right here. This is one of the options, uh, but it also comes here with a copywriter. Basically here at the left side, we have the menu with the options inside of the platform. So you can write copy here, but you can do more than this. You can also use this to reply to user reviews, for example. You can write sales scripts, emails. Uh, you can even write code with it. Basically, it is chat GPT powered, which also enables you to do so. Uh, but now it's stored inside of your AI made account. Now, I think the best thing to do is to just show you uh, what this platform is and how it works. But before I do so, I want to mention that there is a link in the description of this video. It will redirect you to my website where you can find more information also about the funnel. I don't have more information than what you can see here on this page. Um, however, if you like to, you can check out each upsell here by clicking one of these buttons that will redirect you to the upsell pages. If you like to get the bundle deal, uh, you can use coupon... Uh, Tim Bundle, it says AI May Bundle. You can use Tim Bundle. And for the front end, I also have a coupon code Tim Special. You can use that as well. I will change that on the page uh, once you are going to visit it. Uh, also, some extras that you're going to get here. You're going to get all these extra free upgrades if you pick up AI Mate through my link. So, yeah, make sure to check that out. All right, let's dive into this and let me show you how AI Mate works. So we start here at the left menu with the chat GPT copywriter. Now, like I said, you can do multiple things with this copywriter, but let's say you want to have a email that you're going to send for uh, your meditation app. So you can simply give a uh, prompt here. So write an email for my new meditation app. And let's say write a promotional email, promotional email for my new meditation app. Now, when I click on get output, it's going to take a few seconds, probably 10, 15 seconds for AI made to write this email for you. And then it comes here with the email. So as you can see here, subject line, find calm and clarity with our new meditation app. And then it starts here. So you can modify this in here. Uh, greetings, we're thrilled to introduce you to our new meditation app. It's designed to help you achieve a sense of calm and clarity in your life. The app offers guided meditations for various topics like stress, relief, self-reflection, blah, blah, blah. So as you can see here, it just wrote a simple email for me uh, in just a few seconds. And uh, yeah, basically, of course, ChatGPT also allows you to do this. But once you're happy with this, you can also submit this. And now this email has been stored inside of your account. And when you click on this eyeball here, you can always go back to this script here. It's in PDF format. You can download this. You can send it to other people as well. Uh, and it will be stored inside of your account. So uh, that's inside of the copyright. Now, like I said, you can do multiple things. So you can basically ask anything to AI made. So for example, you can also uh, write this response to somebody has, who has rated your app. So let's say you have an app and you want to respond to everyone that has responded or rated your app. You can do something like this. So you can say, write a response for, so let me copy paste something I already uh, wrote here. So here, write a response for what a great meditation app. Love it. Now get output. And now it's going to write something for you here. And this was a quick one. I'm so glad you love it. Meditation is such a powerful tool for reducing stress and anxiety. I'm thrilled that our app has been helpful to you. Thank you for your kind words. We really appreciate your support. So that's another one. And if you're happy with it, and also you can also use the editor here, uh, like making it bold and all the other options inside here so that when you save this, um, your edits also will be saved. So I'm gonna submit this. And now this one is also here in our account. So next one. So let's say you wanna do a write a sales script for uh, my new meditation app. Let's say write a 500 word sales script. 
So I'm click on get output. Now I have to say it won't always create 500 words, um, but sometimes it's short and then I say write 500 words or 1000 words so that it comes up with a longer script for what I'm creating. So here you can see this, it created this sales script for you. Um, you can do this with variety a variety of things so you can also say i want to have a video script for and then it's going to write a video script for you and as you can see here this is something that you can use for your sales script now another thing that it also can do is it can write code for you so for example if you know a little bit about css uh, you can do for example here um write a css code for a pulsing diff uh, named special so named special so if you know a little bit about css code and you want to have something pulsing uh, on your page you can ask uh ai mate how to do this so when i click on get output it's going to give the code for me which i can paste inside of my css document here oh it's already created the code do you see that it's already pulsing here and when you click on code here you get the code here that you can add to your page here so this is a a, a code and a CSS all in one here uh, that you can use. And you can also submit this and now it's being saved. So basically you can ask AI made to do anything uh, and it will be stored inside of your account so that you always have access to it. Now the next part is the AI image generator. Now inside of the image generator, you can basically do anything. So for example, I like this one that I already created. You can give your keywords, so you can basically describe whatever you like. You can set the number of images. So let's say I wanna have four images. I wanna have the medium image size in here, and there are four different sizes or three different sizes here, as you can see, but let's take the medium and I'm gonna click submit. Now I'm also gonna show you something very useful within a second. First let it generate the images so they can see how this looks like. So I did a lake between the mountains with a, uh, with a sunbeam and foggy weather, purple glow. So let's see what it comes up with. This has been created by AI Mate. I think it looks pretty good, right? So this is a very nice image. I really love images like this of nature. Here's another one. Also very beautiful. Here's another one, um, this one. And let's say you want to enlarge the images. I got a very cool tool for you. And this is the tool here. It's um, replicate.com uh, slash nightmare AI slash real as a gam. Now I have to add this to my YouTube description so that you can visit it yourself. Because if you want to enlarge your images, let's say you're in AI made here and you have this image, but you would like to have it very large. You can save this image to your drive here. So let's save this image. When you go to this website here and you use this file, you can scale this. So let's say now it's a scale of eight. Let's say I want to have a scale of, of six here. When I click on submit, it will make this image six times larger than it is right now with a very good quality. Look at this. And when I click on this, look at this. Now this is full, this is my full screen. Do you see how large this image has been created here? And do you see the quality of this image? It's simply very good quality. So every image that you create with AI made here can be enlarged with that tool. That's just an extra plus that you're getting from me uh, as an extra tip. So with the AI image generator, you can basically yeah, create anything. I think you know these tools, right? So it's included inside of AI Mate. Now the next thing is AI image variations. So here you can see I've uploaded an image before of a model. Now when I cl click on generate image variations here, I can say I wanna generate four different images. I wanna have the 1024 by 1024 and then you need to upload here are the instructions you need to upload the image but the image must be png format uh, less than four megabytes and square shape and one of these formats now i already have an image on my desk here um so this is the image that i want to have variations of so let's say i want to have more variations of this model now i click on submit and it's going to create four different variations of this person. And again, this takes 
a certain amount of seconds before it's going to be rendered. So let me pause the video. And there you go. Now we have four different variations of the same person here uh, that you can view and download to your computer. You can do this with any image uh, if you want to have variations of an image that you have on your hard drive. I think it's pretty cool. Then the next thing is here, keyword to image. Now, so let's say I have a fireman here and I want to have uh, I want to have all you can filter this by doing photos illustrations or vector let's say I want to have vectors here when I submit this look at this this is everything no this is not even a fireman did I say fireman it's called a fireman right let's say vector again here fireman I think I typed it wrong so you're going to get all the vectors of fireman here uh, but you can also do um, fireman let's say you want to have photos and you can submit this and it comes up with all photos of fireman so i think that these are uh, royalty free images from a database that's also included inside of ai i'm not sure if these have been generated by ai Let's do one more fireman here and then choose the, the illustrations here. So these are illustrations. I think I had the illustrations at the begin. Fireman. Let's do the vectors here. Well, it's vectors and illustrations together. But basically, you get a whole database here of, of images uh, that you can search for inside of AI Mate. Another thing here is the editor, which is the last part of this application, uh, where you can open photos. So let's say uh, you have this photo in here. Now you can start editing this photo so you can do different filters. So if you like to have this, uh, let's say, Polaroid, you can do that or other filters you can enable or disable this uh, you can resize this here you can crop the images transform draw uh, text shapes stickers for example if you want to add clouds here they also have clouds here you can you can do that as well here uh, put a cloud on your picture it's basically a simple image editor that you can use to add different things corners frames here backgrounds you can change that and once you're satisfied you can click on save and then you can save this to your hard drive and that's basically what ai mate is all about um, and again if you're interested there is a link in the description of this video if you have any questions make sure to ask them in the comments below uh, and please hit that thumbs up if this video was useful for you consider subscribing to my youtube channel if you haven't done yet i do a lot of product reviews hit that notification bell so you get notified each time i upload a new review and for now thank you so much for watching i hope to see you in my next video talk soon cheers